Welcome ladies and gentlemen, I'm here live with the greatest athlete of all time, Jim Thorpe. Jim, people believe you to be one of the greatest athletes of all time. What are your views on that, sir? Well, I'm really flattered, but the real thing I gotta really focus on tonight is going off a victory. Jim, I like your mentality. Jim, the nation feels you're going to lead a victory tonight. What are your thoughts on that? I'm going to pull up that victory tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, it's spoken of a true champion. Everybody, it's Jim Thorpe, pre-game. We thank you all. Ladies and gentlemen, tonight we have Eugene Francis, opposing team of Jim Thorpe. Eugene, tell me what your game plan is tonight for taking down the great Jim Thorpe. Well, sir, this is my first game playing out there tonight. I really want to get them boys tired. Get juice. Well, my, my mentality is I'm just going to bring them down hard and get down, get down low like them football players do. Swipe him through his knees. You know, this is my first game tonight because I'm, I'm backing up. I'm the, I'm the fifth string tonight due to injury. So I'm real excited. I really hope my parents see me and they're proud of me. And I can't wait to take that, that Jim Thorpe down. And there you have it. Eugene Francis, opposing team Jim Thorpe. Hey guys, welcome to the broadcast, and here with me as the great Jim Thorpe. Jim, great, great game out there, son. Great game. Thank you. I'm a little starstruck myself, seeing such a great athlete. Jim, what contributions did you make to the athletic world in the 1920s? Well, you know, through my experience of playing, you know, football, baseball, track and field, I really, you know, raised the bar of sports through my performance and becoming an All-American athlete. Jim, fans of yours in the world here um, believe you to be one of the greatest athletes um, of our century uh, with years to come. And um, what I want you to do is, can you please just list the teams you play for, the sports and all that. Can you just list the teams you play for and uh, pretty much surprise all the audience of how many <laughs> teams you play for? Well, you know, I, I play for, in baseball, I play for the Cleveland Indians. You know, I played for the Orang Indiana, and also I played for the Rock Island Independents. And in football, I played for the Chicago Cardinals, the Canton Bulldogs, and of course, the Great New York Giants. The Great New York Giants, I have to, I have to second that. So with this, you, you played minor league and major league baseball teams, um, football teams, and track and field through the Olympics. Yeah. You have quite a resume of achievements, and I, I just want you to uh, form me a list, and for the broadcast, list your achievements um, that you've accomplished. Well, you know, uh, I was an All-American athlete in the year 1911, 1912. Impressive. And um, they chose me as Olympic. I went to the Olympics, you know, I ran two races. I got two major awards in that. And then also they inducted me in the track and field hall of fame. That's impressive, sir, and I, I believe you have, I mean, you're, you're quite young in your career. You probably have uh, much more awards to come in later years. Jim, me and the audience really want to get inside the real Jim Thorpe. And um, can you please just tell the audience and I um, where you originated from, um, how you got to where you are as a great athlete, and uh, how the people think of you here in the 1920s? Well, you know, I grew up in a pretty small town called Prague, Oklahoma. And, you know, uh, through my hard work and determination, I became the great athlete I am today. You know, I, I consider myself as a really humble guy. You know, the people, they look up to me as, as an athlete because of my hard work. And this is how I, I go out there and do my job. That's great. A real humble guy um, being paid off for what he does and what he worked hard for. You've obviously affected us here in the present uh, in the 1920s. But what I want to ask of you is, what are your future goals and your future way of impacting people in the future? Well, you know, hopefully I'm looking forward to creating the National Football League and also playing in that league to achieve, you know, maybe being inducted to their Hall of Fame. Also, I'd like to not also be a present player, but maybe be a worldwide century athlete of the future and just be a role model to young football players in their coming years. Everybody, it's Jim Thorpe. He's looking to be a, um, not only a present athlete, but to be known for uh, times to come. Everybody? 
Jim, I want to thank you. Thank you. Broadcast, we are signing out. Everybody, the great Jim Thorpe.